Hey guys, Hardcore Panda here. On my last video, I showed you how my GTX was working with a uh, very old CPU and it's not performing very good, right? So I got a new CPU now, 6700, okay? And let's see how it's working. So this is um, Overwatch and as you can see, all the settings are maxed out and I'm getting 100 F frame per second and it's quite steady so this is the um, graph for my new CPU performance you can see it's using most of the GPU all the time like steady almost at 99% and not using much of CPU so I guess it's good and previously I was getting only 76 FPS and now I'm getting 105 so that's a big um, gain so that's like 38% uh, FPS gain from using a uh, old GPU and a uh, new GPU and uh, which is really impressive like if you think like just by replacing the CPU you can get a lot of FPS if you're using um, very old CPU I recommend like getting a new CPU like something like 6700k or you can wait for AMD Gen if you want and uh, let's look at some more gameplay then we move on to different games Um, this is Witcher 3 and everything is maxed out as well see you can see the frame has been really good now it's uh, over 90% uh, before it was only 62 so it's like 100 FPS now that's 61% is gain once again it's using the most of my GPU which is really good and CPU not much I guess because uh, 6700k is really powerful and GPU 1070 is utilizing the most of it so I'm really happy with the performance um, oh by the way the hair works is off uh, I know it's a bit buggy like you don't see any change if you have it on but it's better to leave it off I guess because no it doesn't make much difference besides it hurts your FPS a lot and this is doom doom is on its max setting as well and the graphics looks really great now this is the best looking games out of all three I think I haven't included uh, Dark Souls 3 though because it's caps at 60 FPS so I don't see much different anyway to with room again this is like gave me like almost 52 percent from uh, using a 6700 game before I was using 1090T so that's a massive gain it's a frame per second is 142 this is huge again uh, it's using my GPU the most so which is really good and CPU is already like most all of these games are using like on at most 40% of it and not much but it's using a lot of GPU so, and the temperature remains good too like it's uh, it doesn't go more than 65 max maybe it's always under 70 70 degree so uh, let's have uh, maybe we can do more CPU intensive game the one I have that's total warhammer oops but I guess it doesn't work for me so overall you can see the difference you can get after replacing your CPU it's a massive gain uh, each game have gave me at least like around 40 percent so which is really good anyway guys have fun and I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you